mentoring you using Ngoma dialogue, so called Ngoma DJ. Why is youth mentoring in church and school important? Kenya is a youthful country, 75% of the population is 18 to 35, and we have to take care of this group because it's a major asset for Kenya. And if we don't take care of them, then there are many consequences, economic, political, cultural, that might affect us. How does mentoring in church and school help the youth? Help them set smart goals, specific, measurable, attainable, re relevant, and time-bound. And mentoring helps them go through challenges yeah, that happen at home. It helps them deal with stressful situations like an absent father, alcoholic father, or incest maybe. Helps them transit from a home to the world of work or marriage. Mentored youth have fewer absences from school, better attitude towards family, home, church, school, fewer incidents of fighting, fewer alcohol uh, abuse cases, and they have a more positive attitude towards their elders. However, youth mentoring in Kenyan churches and schools are not transforming because they are adults centered rather than youth. Adults develop the whole program without involving the youth, and hence the programs are not youth friendly. They do not resonate with the youth because they are out of touch with the reality and the challenges of the youth. As mentoring programs in Kenya are conducted using chalk and talk method of teaching. This is a formal, non-participatory method where the mentoring is, or the mentor uses the blackboard and the mentor's voice are key. The mentees sit passively waiting to be filled like empty vessels. They are not involved in discussing as if they have nothing to contribute. Mentoring youth using Goma Dialogue Circle, and this is what I introduced because it is youth culture centered, young people on the communicative process. They are part of the production of the program and it's important because they bring their own challenges and they'll find solutions. It doesn't mean the adult won't be there, the adult is a facilitator. It uses all forms of communication, even vernacular and Goma or artistry, creates positive communication climates where the youth feel free to discuss their problems and find solutions. I did mentor youth at SEK Cathedral Church in Boy using Goma Dialogue Circles. Take a look. The whole idea of the activity is we are setting and achieving goals. The train is like we are moving to our goals. So the goals have to be specific, measurable, attainable, relevant, time bound. But they are challenges, and these challenges will make them aware. One, personal challenges, that's why we have their hands tied at the back. We also have the balancing of the balloon. These are other challenges when you interact with others, especially significant others, teachers, parents, in the village. And then you have the obstacles as you move around. There's the chairs, there's the corners you're making, which as you can see, it's difficult for the train. These are socio-economic challenges. The balloon comes out of one of them, then they stop and start again. It just tells them in life, you will fail and we learn through failures so quickly reorganize yourself here now is the dialogue circle in action take a look we're talking about friends challenges to distract us from achieving our goals peer pressure what are the, uh, the challenges from friends so the whole goma dialogue is youth culture center they very try good. it very good now you're running the yeah. class very well okay what are the drugs uh-huh. Uh-huh. All right. Very good. Now let's start seeing how we can overcome them, okay? Overcome. Okay, run the class. What is your name again? Mary. Mary. Mary, you're doing a good job. Give a hand for Mary. Clap for Mary. Clap for Mary. Clap for Mary. Uh-huh. Start. Yeah. We have to go to the challenges. So we look for how we can overcome these challenges. The first one, peer pressure. How can you overcome peer pressure? Anyone? Let's get, what do you want to do in school? You want to actually be the best known in terms of smoking ban? Huh? What do you want? What is your goal in school? That, to get an A in physics, to get an A in the whole aggregate.
have a sense of ownership. They have the solution. Peter is reading from experts from this book, Attitude of Can Do, Banish Your Fears, and we discuss it, or we let the young people discuss it. When they make their goals, we get them to actually include them in uh, my 15 hour day planner. So we have those two resources. How to use your 15 hour daily planner. It shows uh, an example there. We have weekly progress there. Shows you an example where they need to write. The right targets for the coming week. Target met this past month. target to meet this coming month for this workshop at your church contact dr mjomba majalia 0708 032388 malimwako at gmail.com